Hi YouTube, this is Credit Tips. It's been a long time since I saw you. Yeah. Um, <clears throat> I'm doing good. Uh, the, my credit's gradually growing. I mean, I'm I'm not. I don't care about it really, so it don't matter to me. But if you're really into, like, say, you want to build your credit big time. I mean, big time. This is my best solution for you. Go to your bank. If you have a bank account, go to your bank. Ask one of the tellers or the people behind the camera and ask them, do you have a secured credit card? A secure credit card. That will build your credit up so good. But, a what's the difference from a secure credit card and an unsecured credit card, if you don't know, is a secure credit card is your own money. You're building it. See, what you're doing is, say if, for example, and you don't want to use all your credit up on a secure credit card. That makes it look bad for other, you know, I mean, looks bad on your credit report. So, like, say if you get a $300 credit line, at the most half of it. Like $150, $200 at most. Don't spend it all. Excuse all that noise in the background. My brother's like deaf. But um, anyways. Um, so basically do that. It goes, most banks when they start a credit line, it goes from $300 to $3,000. Now you got to pay cash now. You gotta pay the cash. So basically what you're doing is you're telling the banks that I swipe my card, I use my credit card, and I could pay you back. That's what basically you're doing. I'm using two hundred dollars, I could pay you back two hundred dollars. You're like showing them saying I could pay. And then sometimes what they do is they give you an unsecured credit card. Now I'm gonna tell you what an unsecured credit card is. Everybody has it, especially if they have, well, okay credit, fair credit, as they say. An unsecured credit card is the bank's money. The bank's giving you money. So, like, say if you're getting mail, congratulations, you're pre-approved, $500, and so such, you know. That's an unsecured credit card. A secure credit card is you using your money. So, see, some people don't understand that. Some people say, well, if I'm using my own money, how is that building my credit? Because you're paying the bank back what you use from that credit card you're basically shown that okay I can pay you what I used and then whenever you used like say like I said say if you use a hundred fifty two hundred dollars okay during that month you used hundred fifty to two hundred dollars you want to pay that back because you want to show the bank that you can pay it. So, that's what I, I want to get. And your your credit will build really, really, really good. So, that's another thing. I'm in the check system. Everybody knows that. I think I even made a video a long time ago that I made one. Because what happened was I needed money so bad and I had to do it. I didn't have bills to pay. I didn't have nothing coming out really. So, uh, you know, I wanted to tell you guys best card ever. And I'm not sponsored with this. Best prepaid card you can ever ever imagine in the world you could be in the check system anything smart access 
smart access smart and then a c c e s s i'll put the link in the description go on a smart access apply nine out of ten times you're going to be approved it don't matter if you're in a check system or not and they give it to you you pay five dollars a month for maintenance fee and the only reason why they charge you five dollars a month is because if something happens like if you you lost your card or something like that they don't charge you it's only if you know you um you got direct deposit you could do um they don't have bill pay that's the only thing they don't have but you could set up automatic payments because it's a debit card. Reoccurring payments rather than say. But it's good. So I have I've been having that since I was in the check system. I was in the check system since fifteen. I haven't I haven't had a chance to pay it back, so I So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna tell you guys if you're trying to build your credit even though you're still in debt, you can still build it, but it'll be, it still will be, your credit won't build as fast because, you know, you're in debt. Like, see me, I still owe about 4000 about four, four or 5000 I was 10000 in debt, about, so I'm about half. So what I'm going to do is, maybe when I get down to 3000 I'm going to open a secure credit card. Yep. Yeah. Because I think it's going to build my credit real good. I'm going to try to get a $500 secure credit card. Because. Um, that shows you how well. See it's getting dark. Excuse the light. See how, um, how good your your credit will be building up over time. It might take a year. It depends how bad your credit is so yeah that's my best solution just get a secure credit card and, and you're good uh, I'll probably make a video later on because I didn't really plan this video so that's all I'll talk to y'all later thanks for watching have a great day bye